Hey, what's up guys? This is Jacob with Moreno's Landscaping and Lawn Maintenance out here in uh, beautiful Florida, Central Florida. Uh, all right, guys, I've been trying to keep up with the vlogs. I'm, I'm seriously, I've been trying to keep up, but man, it has been hot and humid and wet and everything in between. Uh, and plus, I didn't want to video, video anything where, where I'm crying because my back hurts, my legs hurt, my arms hurt. So, I, so I didn't want to, you know, post anything like that. You know, these are videos. I want to post everything good, you know, good stuff. Well, now, nah, well, anyways, guys. So last week was the holidays. We took we took off last week, or actually we worked three days. So this whole week we have just been trimming and trimming and trimming because everybody fertilized two weeks ago or last week, and this week everything is just popping and yeah. So anyway, I just want to show you something. All right, so there's my, the legustrum trees. Got these here. Got these, the same house. Y'all seen this house already. But this is what I'm show you the legustrum trees. Cause I actually, let's, Sparky's been doing all my trimming, all like all the tall stuff, all, all my tall hedges and trees. Cause I think I'm getting a little too old to be going up and down that ladder. So, but I gotta say, this trimming, it's starting to get real good. I'm real, I'm real satisfied the way he trimmed these little dustin trees. They're, they're nice and tight, and he trimmed a lot off of these. This is a bottle brush. Uh, this, is, this is pretty cool too. These you can make them to trees, shrubs, when they grow these um, flowers here. It's called the bottle brush, because it looks like a bottle brush cleaner. <laughs> but these are nice. But we're gonna let this grow. But you can see, the windows can see over so they want that privacy so we're gonna let these grow these actually grow up maybe about 12 or 15 feet so we're just gonna let them grow all the way all the way to their complete height so but yeah so we're at our first property here and i just thought of, you know show you the the legustrum trees because i think he did a really good job i trimmed all the low stuff so of course that's gonna be tight, cause of course, cause I did it. <laughs> well, anyways, guys, we're at our first property. Uh, see what I get, what I can get. Uh, sorry, see you in a bit. What I need you to do is get all the leaves, break it into the, for the grass area. Get, get all the leaves, break it into the grass area. We're gonna mow it. We'll try to mulch it or we'll pick it up with the bag. Disperse it into the, to the grass. So you want me to put it in the bag? With the no, bag? mulch, break it into the grass. Okay. What I want to do, I want to find out what is better, bagging or mulching the clippings with the 30 inch mower.
for me I think the bagging is better um, it left the area cleaner compared to mulching where it kind of made everything look I don't know just look dirtier um, so I think bagging bagging was better for me just, it just seems like it was left there and the grass cleaner <clears throat>
All right, guys. So I got this. It's called what? It's called fast strap. Hmm. It's okay. It's not. It's not uh, what I thought it was gonna be. It's pretty simple. I was hoping to get something that was that easier to lock the equipment. Like this one. I got this. This is a. It's called a jungle boot. And this one here, all you do is just pop it out and pop it in and it stays so I was hoping to, to do something like that with this one but it's all right so I'm, I'm using it for now for a couple of weeks and then about them I'm gonna order the power the power lock so I'm gonna try that if uh, any of y'all try the power lock hey let me know hit, hit me up on the, uh, on the comments and whatever let me know what y'all think about it and all right Alright, so we got done trimming. One of my favorite houses. <clears throat> I didn't do the trees. I didn't do the spirals. the top hedges in the back like this viburnum I didn't do this viburnum here hurt these steps in here a couple years ago it came out pretty good. Grass looks clean. I had to pass it maybe about eight times. <laughs> Cut about, I don't know, what, four or five inches off of this. But, mm, grass looks clean. Anyway. All right, guys, I'm calling it a day. We did four properties a day, did a lot of trimming, we did, you know, we got a little bit of rain, a lot of sun, a lot of humidity, but it's, it's been a long day. So, we're about, we're, the guys are wrapping it up, and, well, anyways, guys, thank you for watching. Uh, thank you for, uh, like, uh, what is that, if you, ain't, if you ain't subscribed, subscribe, you know, it doesn't hurt to subscribe. Um, again, guys, just thank you for watching. And stay strong and stay focused. And with this heat, stay hydrated. All right, guys. Peace out.